Hi, I'm Mike Garcia and here now for about over 11 years. Um, I have a beautiful wife that comes and loves going boating with me and we have four wonderful kids that like to come out here and boat with us. I have uh, two boys and two girls and um, I was a wee little child. Um, now uh, about 30 years ago I, I got my first boat um, and used to fish off the St. John's River and that started the love for actually coming in and becoming a boater. I grew up in South Florida and my grandparents lived in the Keys so we always boated with my grandfather and Mike's always loved boating. So one of our first dates that Mike took me on was on our old boat and we were in the St. John's River and we were having dinner and the boat died and it was nighttime. I love telling this story. <laughs> oh, it was nighttime and we couldn't get back to the dock, so he had to jump in what I consider alligator-infested waters and pull the boat back to shore. So that was how I knew he was the man for me. I think that um, just being up here in Mount Dora, the positive boat feeling is that there's those mornings when you come out and the lake is just crystal clear glass and you got the most beautiful sunrise coming up behind you and you're just enjoying that nice breeze, especially around like January, February time when most people can't boat down here in Florida, we can boat. And the mornings remind you that we are in a special place. Uh, also having dinner, like one of the biggest things that we love doing here, especially living here in Lake County and being able to be at the marina and just have somebody call up, hey, uh, get my boat ready. You know, we, we come in, we grab the boat, uh, me and her are dressed up and we get for a quick ride across the lake and then we end up in a beautiful sunset with dinner from one of the restaurants around here. So that's the, that's the joy and the power about being here in our uh, little city. And, and one of the nice things about that is that we, again, we call you guys and you guys have the boat ready for us and it's just easy to trailer it. It's easy to go out in the lakes. And our family from out of town, when they come into town, the awesome. one thing they want to do is go out on the lakes with us. And that's special. In my law enforcement days, uh, I remember calling the owner um, in the middle of the night saying that we had a boat um, who was putting out an SOS and they were catching on water and the engine had shut off. Came out, we both went out together um, and uh, I jumped out of the police car, he jumped in the boat, and both of us went out and we started trying to find this person in the middle of the night and um, we exhausted the whole lakeside and Joe would not give up. And that was what I learned and appreciate about him. He doesn't give up and he always pushes to the next level. And that's not only here trying to find this person who was uh, sinking in their boat, because we did find him and we did rescue them and tow them back. Um, but it was more than the fact that he does that here at the marina for us. Like everyone at the marina has that same attitude. They go a step beyond. If I come in the, the morning and say, I need my boat done, they, they come in and they, they'll help us clean it off and they'll wipe it down, they'll bring it out. Uh, hey, if it's really raining really bad, they'll come out and help you. Um, the other thing too is the experience. Because you're in a marina setting, um, a lot of times we're afraid to ask questions. Here, no one ever is afraid to ask a question um, or, or, or if, if there's a solution that can be given to us quickly. Uh, the marina comes up with it. And I think this boating center is the perfect idea for family. Um, especially if you're new to boating or you're not new to boating.